This headline-making, wondrous, and extraordinary event literally swept the world. On September 22, 1995, eyewitnesses in India began reporting accounts of Hindu statues drinking milk. The word spread quickly. Before long, the Delhi and Bombay stock exchanges were closed, so traders could feed the statues. Then, the federal government closed down. Within 72 hours, statues were reportedly consuming milk by the leader in Hindu communities around the world. Millions flocked to temples and shrines in the United States, Hong Kong, Canada, and Indonesia. In London, it was at the Vishwa Temple that the tiny marble statue of Nandi, the cosmic bull, began drinking milk. Tom Leonard, a reporter for London's Evening Standard, was more than just a witness. I held the spoon up. The, a man, an assistant, was holding it slightly for me. Now, he tipped the spoon slightly when it reached the elephant's mouth, but not enough to justify what then happened, was the milk just sucked up completely from the spoon. Now, the second time, I actually asked if I could just hold the spoon myself, and I did, and no one held my hand then, and it still got sucked up. Patricia Miller of Miracles magazine believed this was definitely a miraculous event. It was a bizarre, bizarre story. And it flashed around the world, and then it went in about three days. Everyone I talked to was mystified. This had credibility because it happened in so many places to so many people. Religious statues have a long history of displaying miraculous signs. In Akita, Japan, from 1975 to 1981, this wooden statue cried and bled more than a hundred times. There were so many witnesses that the Roman Catholic Church officially approved Akita as a miracle worthy of belief. And in 1994, members of this Coptic church in Brooklyn, New York, witnessed what they considered God's presence in the form of an icon that wept tears of oil. The oil was coming from all parts of this icon, from here to there, anywhere. And when you put your finger on the icon, you can find some traces of oil. Father Mina Yani has been the priest there for over 20 years. In an effort to prove that it wasn't some trick, he mounted the icon on a new frame, onto which it continued to ooze oil. What it means? <laughs> it means that there's something abnormal. It means that something happened after that. When we took some of the oil and some of the people who are sick anointed themselves, they are cured. Yanni keeps the medical reports on file, like this one from a woman who was diagnosed with breast cancer, only to have it disappear after rubbing herself with the oil. What it means, miracle or not miracle? 